Hello everyone. Welcome to Beta Code. In this video, we will be talking about how to install and configure Eclipse in Windows 11. So this will be basically two process method. Step one will be installing Java in your system and then we can install Eclipse. So to check if Java is installed or not in your system, you have to first open your command prompt to so search for cmd click enter and then write java hyphen hyphen version so if java is installed in your system you will be able to see this java version if this is not showing in your system that means uh, you have not installed the java yet. so first you will have to install java and for that i have created a separate video i will put the link also in the description or you can check in on the i button here okay so the second step i will uh, take you through that is installing eclipse so for that we will go to google and search for eclipse here just click on the first search result uh, once this link is open here you can see this download button click on this Here scroll down and we will be able to see installer download this one now once again click on this uh, download link so it will start download let it download first Okay, so now it's uh, download with success. Uh, we will go to the downloads folder. And now we can see uh, this installer is downloaded properly. Now uh, we have to double click on this. So it will start a Eclipse installer. So it is starting now. okay so now this eclipse installer is started and here we can see different options so uh, from here we can select uh, whichever eclipse we needed so for now we will be using this eclipse id for java so click on this eclipse id for java and here we can select the installation location also and also you have to select this uh, java installed uh, location so automatically it detects your location installation location uh, if environment variable is set correctly and this installation folder and then click on install click on just click on accept now and installation is started now you can see the installation is successful here we got the launch button so click on this uh, it will start your eclipse so here you can see uh, the workspace location it is showing so by default it is in c drive eclipse workspace you can copy this location also for uh, further reference because uh, your project will be saved in this location only you can change this also but i will keep it as default and click on launch so now you can see uh, it launched the eclipse and it is installed successfully now we can see uh, eclipse is installed correctly uh, in our system 
and if you want to uh, change the theme of this uh, eclipse then we have to go to windows preferences and here we can search for theme and click on appearance and here you can see uh, there may be some other options so let me select light or classic apply and then it will ask to restart once we restart our applied theme will be correctly configured so now if we launch we will get the classic theme uh, eclipse id yes so it is the theme is updated now okay now i will let you know uh, how to create a sample project in eclipse so for that you will have to go to file click on new and then select the java project and here it will ask for the project name so give some project name like uh, i am giving beta code and here it will uh, automatically select your uh, installed java version jre and jdk details then click on next and click on finish so now your project is created and you can see one src folder get got created now here we will have to create a java file so for that first i will go to src right click on this new and first i will create a package so click on package and here you can give the package name so something like from dot test i'm giving and click on finish so now this package is created inside this package we can create new class file java class also so new and then select the class here give the class name i'm giving as a hello world and uh, we want some main method also so select on this click on finish so now you can see uh, a java file uh, with class name hello world got created and there is a main method now we can write some code inside it so i will write a statement print hello world welcome to beta code now to run this file you can directly right click on this and run as java application so you can see the output now here and another option to run it is at the top you can see uh, this play button that is run button basically so click on this it will run your java file so that's all for today uh, thank you for uh, watching this video.